We'll start and finish this mid-June update with a view of the Wolf Islander 3. Work to consolidate the piles below what will be the passenger terminal involves a great deal of grout. Note in the background here the removal of gravel, now surplus to requirements. The telehandler here has just filled the on-site concrete mixer, providing material for the piles and the basket being inserted. As work on each set of piles is completed, it becomes necessary to move the crane mats. If you look closely in these views, beneath the square covers, there are the piles. On the south side of the dock, what is now likely to be the utility building, where batteries, generators and other equipment will be, work advances steadily. And recently, what appear to be foam boards for a concrete bore are visible. Work on the finger dock involves enormous preparation, which means that it's often difficult to see change. But it's almost constantly receiving attention. On the other side of the ramp, divers and a crane have been busy installing cross pieces. leading to this situation just last week. It seems clear that something is to be laid on top of these. As promised at the outset, we'll close with a view of the Wolf Islander 3 discharging her cargo in Kingston. Thanks for watching.